Good morning, Patriots. Welcome back to Rex Pines TV. I'm Giselle Adams. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for our school mission statement. We the Patriots achieve greatness through high expectations, passion, and perseverance. Thank you. You may now be seated. Today is Monday, October 9th, 2023. Now let's go learn something new about Hispanic heritage with Catherine. Buen dia, Patriots. Today we'll be talking about the sword lily flower. This type of flower blooms in the early summer and is originated from Mexico. The sword lily comes in a lot of different colors, such as orange, pink, purple, and bright red. As the name mentions, the sword lily has a similar shape to a sword, and it is also mostly found in the Mexican celebration Day of the Dead. The Day of the Dead is a joyful celebration that helps people to remember their past relatives and celebrate them. And that is very important to people from Mexico. Did you know the sword lily means sympathy and memories? What a beautiful flower. That was great. Now let's go to Daniela for today's tasty lunch. Thank you, Catherine. Today's lunch is chicken nuggies, turkey and cheese deluxe hoagie, sweet potato waffle fries, cucumber, garden salad, mandarin oranges, and your choice of milk. Tomorrow's breakfast is egg and cheese breakfast burrito, frosted cornflakes, graham crackers, fresh orange, and 100% apple juice. Students, please note that the lunch menu can change any day. And to always bring your lunch card and don't forget to inform your teachers if you will be receiving lunch today. Bon appetit and let's go back to Giselle. Patriots, our Kindness Spirit Week continues. Tomorrow on Tuesday, all students can wear purple to show the fear and courage are the best companions. I love this. For today's Hispanic Heritage activity, please research some historical figures. As Ellen Ochoa once said, education is what allows you to stand out. Patriots, remember it's important to keep your phone shut down and in your backpacks at all times. And also remember, there is no chewing gum in school, so make sure to spit it out before entering the building. 11 days, Patriots! The challenge ends on the 20th. We know you can do it! And don't forget that your reward will be beyond this world. The girls' basketball trials are being held this week, Wednesday, October 11th. The requirements for the trials are completed physical, completed grade sheet with parent signature. Trial will be at 4 to 5.30. The 27th is the dance. It's only for K through 5th. It will be so much fun. I just know it. Remember to pay $5 and no referrals throughout the month. I know you all will have fun. We will be looking for gold in a chicken nugget extravaganza on the 27th, same as the barnyard dance. You will need to pay $5 and no referrals. We know you can do it. It's our boo grams. What a great chance to scare your peers. Order before the 25th or before items sold out. The fee is $5. Boo, did I get ya? Games, raffles, famous haunted hallways, and the best one, candy. They will all be presented on the, at the Fall Festival. Tickets are on myschoolbooks.com. The festival is on the 28th. Let's see your scary costume. And let's feel the breeze with Camilo. Hey Patriots, today's weather is 85 degrees Fahrenheit with rainy showers. Make sure to pack an umbrella. In other weather news, Lake Tahoe's water has reached the clearest it's ever been in 40 years. Lake Tahoe's water gets clearer and clearer due to tiny creatures known as zooplankton. Zooplankton are small animals in the Platonic community. Now all the jet skiers, hikers, boat viewers, and fishers can have much more of an amazing experience at Lake Tahoe. I'll be making sure to pack some swimming clothes soon. Now let's go to Elia for today's birthdays. Thank you, Camilo. Today's birthday boys and girls are Elizabeth Alvarez, Jaden Chambers, Emily Rojas, and Sofia Lopez. Happy birthday, now let's go back to Giselle. Thank you, Elia. Patriots, here are your past expectations. It represents present yourself positively, act kindly towards others, treat the school's environment respectfully, and succeed at everything. Teachers, by popular demand, we are bringing back the Daily Challenge. Daily Challenge. Today's Daily Challenge is Which Bird Flies Backwards? Teachers, please send your answers to pines.renaissance at gmail.com before 9 a.m. in order for your answers to be reviewed. Winners will be announced on the next morning announcement. 
Everyone at RPCV would like to wish you all a marvelous Monday. Have an awesome day!